Let's solve the following problem. Um, I'm going to use the quotient rule. So what that means is I'm going to have d dx of cosine x times the sine of x minus uh, cosine x times d dx of sine of x all over um, sine of x squared. So we end up with is uh, negative sine of x times sine of x minus cosine of x times cosine of x. And we have sine of x, sine squared of x. So what happens here is, um, move this up here. So I get negative sine squared x minus cosine squared x all over sine squared x. Um, what I can do here is factor out a negative one, so I get sine of x, or sine squared of x plus cosine squared of x all over sine squared of x. And this is equal to one. So it's just negative one on top over sine squared of x. And what we end up with is um, negative cosecant, oops, cosecant squared of x. And that's it. All right, I hope that helps. Thanks for watching.